Good morning. How are you all? I haven't been on here for ages. I think the last daily vlog I did was when we went out to the big sheep. Careful. Um, I am. And I had some watermelon ice cream. <laughs> I am going to try a bit harder to do some more daily vlogs. Um, I speak on my Instagram stories every day, no problem, but doing a video for on here, I feel a bit more pressure, I feel it needs to be really good and interesting, um, but it is just memories for me to look back on, it doesn't matter if people don't watch us, um, so yeah, I really want to start making a conscious effort of doing our daily lives. Um, Today's not going to be anything exciting. I'm just having a home day today. I've propped myself in front of the window because the lighting is so bad in this house. Um, so yeah, um, I'm just going to get the girlies some breakfast in a minute and Martin is going to do, <coughs> go and get our click and collect. So I will film that, but that will be in a separate video. Hey. Ooh. So yes, I thought I'd come on, start the vlog, say good morning. Um, let's do that on with breakfast. What? Right then, what do you want for breakfast this morning? Uh, pan au chocolat. Pan au chocolat? You don't want some cereal? Uh. No? My girls aren't big fans of cereals, so pan au chocolat for her. Getting my orders in. Sorry, it's dark out here. Oh! <laughs> Nearly. <laughs> Nearly, what do you want for breakfast? Oh, don't look like a baby. Say it again, you can say it. Pan of chocolate. <laughs> Pan of chocolate. So you're just going to have some fruit, which she'll chuck everywhere, but she does love a bowl of fruit. Going to say good morning, Daddy, now you're dressed. Hello. <laughs> oh, look at the shit hole in the background. Oh, what a sight for the morning. Ah, uh, Martin's hurt his shoulder, haven't you, love? Mm -hmm. Let me do my Peter Andres. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he fell to the ground the other day, didn't you? You had a shock up your back. Oh, yeah. Just, really nice. just um, fell to the ground, so he's hurt himself. So he's stinking of um, deep heat, which I hate. Um, all your work makes us whinging yeah. about it as well, aren't they? Yeah. Um, but if it's if he's in pain, you know who cares? I love the smell of the deep freeze stuff. Let's stand by the window; the lighting will be better. Yeah, deep freeze stuff is lovely. So, yes, you're going to go get the shopping now, aren't you? Yeah. And then he's off to work. I'm riding it solo again, so here we go. myself back down here because it's the only decent bit of lighting at the moment because it's really dark outside it's like an autumn day um girlies are just sitting down having their breakfast martin's just left to go and get our food shop um so you're gonna hear them in the background because they're playing about um i did give my tash a wax yesterday it's been driving me insane and I did my eyebrows slightly, they do need a bit of a pluck still but I think I might just leave them <coughs> as they are. Um, I think a, a lot, well not a lot, but some things have changed since I've last been on here. So Martin has changed jobs, he's gone back to an old job so he's now um, working as a chef back um, in a hotel he used to work in which actually benefits our family. He's had he's taken a pay cut that doesn't benefit our family but um um we get to see him every afternoon he has split shifts so we get to see him for 
a good few hours in the afternoon which family time is much more important to us than money so that's been really nice obviously i haven't filmed anything through the summer holidays i have on instagram but not on here um so yeah what have you guys been up to this summer holidays the first few weeks girls can you just lower the tone lulu don't do that to woody she's getting him to drink her drink <laughs> um yeah so the first couple of weeks we literally didn't do anything we spent a lot of time at home um i do spend a lot of time at home anyway me and martin car share so if he's got the car for work then we're usually at home but he is very good he lets me have the car whenever i want it but the last few weeks have been absolutely manic we've had um we've done some really nice things i did a post on instagram the other day saying that i had all these visions and dreams of how summer holidays would be and it hasn't been that at all um i just wanted to be honest um i had it all perfect in my head and actually it's been damn hard work i've done pretty much most of the summer holidays on my own i do go to work two days a week which martin has the girls then but yeah and financially everything costs money if you want to go and take them out to do something so what i've done with my girls is try and find free activities for us to do which we've had such fun doing and it hasn't cost me anything yeah it's cost me if we've gone out for dinner or or something like that but um yeah i can't afford to be paying for this day out paying for that day out some of the theme parks to get into a 15 pound per person that's a lot when there's five of us um so yeah some of the things that we've done have gone to like um a shopping center that's just up the road from us and they've had like free activities on so we got to watch a circus kind of thing it was all right ava really enjoyed it it wasn't the best from an adult's point of view but from a child's point of view she really enjoyed it girls calm down please the noise the noise level oh my god anyone else getting driven mad by the noise please don't scream i don't like it this is my reality i'm not cutting it out because this is the reality and this is truth of motherhood no screaming can you give her some more strawberries please that's why sophie's screaming yeah so We've also watched um, an animal show. That's really good. I might book to go in up to see him. I think you, I'm not sure how much it is. I don't think it's really expensive to go and see him. And you're in a small group and you get to go and see him for an hour. But he's very, very good and really tells you a lot about the animals. You can in a second. Let mummy finish talking and I will get you one. Um, what else have we done? We've done uh, like a crazy golf thing that they've got up there um, and it was Toy Story themed. That you made a donation for. The girls had a face paint. Can I show them my Toy Story? Go on then. Um, you've got chocolate face now. Lily wants to show you Woody. Yes. Okay, I will get it once I finish speaking, okay? Um, yeah, so we did that. Um, the girls had a face paint, which they'd never had a face paint before, so that was their first one. It was very busy, the queue, but thankfully we was one of, we was near the beginning of the queue. So Ava had a butterfly, and, um, Libby had a princess. She, they looked beautiful. Um, they were only very small ones because the lady was on her own and needed to get through the queue quickly. Again, that was free. You didn't have to pay anything for that, which I think is really generous. But you could pay a donation if you wanted to, which we did do. Um, what else have we done? I've taken Ava for a late night walk on the beach when the others were asleep and Martin was home. Um, can talk. He can talk, yeah. Um... <laughs> What else have we done? We've gone to the park, we've been to the paddling pool because there's a, like a little pool in one of the parks. Can you give her some more strawberries? Thank you. Um, they've all gone? She's not eating all of them already. Mummy, get you some more in a minute. Um, yeah, what else have we done? Just, I'm trying to give you free ideas as well. 
you know, walks are free, going to the parks free. We've gone over to see my mum and she's done baking with the girls. We've done baking at home. They've done arts and crafts at home. Um, yeah, I just, I want, I want the girls to have fun during the holidays, but um, it can't always be at an, an, it's, an, at an expense, is what I'm trying to say. Um, we've also been to the library as well, which they really enjoyed doing that. So that's, that's it. Um, what else? Sophie is starting to walk. Um, last, on her birthday vlog, you um, might have seen she took, she would take a couple of steps to us. Careful, do not get your pants up, please. Keep that down. You're going to get changed because I'm going to be telling you that all day. Um, but she can walk from one side of the room to the other. She still isn't walking all the time, but she is getting there. We've made progress. Right. You mostly can't even hear me anyway through this noise, so the kids want more food, so that's what I'm going to go do. What a bloody disaster. So I've just filmed my shopping. And Sophie's been like that in the background the whole bloody time. Or towards the end anyway. So that was fun. But anyway, let's put this away. You can watch me put the food shop away in a time lapse. Shopping is put away and then I had a sudden realisation. I didn't realise what the time was, so it's 10 to 10. And I thought that's why Sophie was getting Aggie in the background. It's because it's nap time. So I'm going to go put her upstairs now for a nap. Martin, bless him, come home with one of these for me. What is it? Peach iced tea. But what he actually went up for was... Um, I said, oh, I've seen on TikTok though, Sunset, I'm not sure what it is, Sunset drink um, from Starbucks. I'd like to try that. So he went up to try and get one, bless him, but they didn't have it. So he got me a peach iced tea. Nice. I love the Lifton one, you know, that you can just buy in the shop, the iced tea. Love that. That's actually really nice. It tastes cucumbery. Oh, I just spat. <laughs> I can taste like a hint of cucumber in that, but I like that. Um, yeah, I never go to Starbucks. He said that nearly cost him a fiver. I was like, flipping heck, I wouldn't have paid that. I would have just gone, no thanks, I'll leave it. See you later. Um, Sophie, Sophie's emptying my washing machine. So once she's up napping, I'm gonna come down. I need to wash these bottles that are in here. And then I need to tackle that laundry basket. Have you seen that hovering in the background whilst I've been vlogging this morning? Um, so I'm going to get some laundry on. I really, really, let's hold you on that because my arm is aching. Oh, shit up. Um, I really need, yeah, to cut the girls' toenails, all of them. Sophie is fine. She doesn't really make a fuss. You know, she moves her feet, but she's a baby. But she sits there, she doesn't cry or anything ava absolutely loves it, me doing her nails she doesn't fuss at all but livy oh my goodness she creates a big old hoo-ha she gets so upset um when i say it's time to <laughs> that looks really creepy ava <laughs> hovering in the background that doll um you don't want to join in so what i thought i would try and do with her is she gets really really upset about having her toenails cut i can do her fingernails absolutely fine there's no fussing at all she really doesn't like the feeling of her toen toenails being cut so if you have any suggestions of how we can like overcome this please comment below um because it's such an ordeal for her and i hate her getting so upset so i try i say you can watch mummy's phone here comes the creepy doll again um i say you can watch mummy's phone so she's distracted whilst i do it um i've done it after the bath so her toenails are soft so i thought oh i know what i'll try today i said so i told the girls this morning why don't we do like a little spa 
um, morning. So once Sophie's down for her nap, I said, we'll get a bowl of warm water. You can soak your feet in so your nails soften up. And I'll cut them and I'll paint them just to try and make it an enjoyable experience for her. She's already saying she doesn't want to take part. You just heard her come in. So, yeah, if you've got any tips on how we can overcome it, please send me a suggestion because it's really not nice and I can't stand long toenails it's a bugbear of mine I really hate it um, so I have to do them and I've even tried doing them when she's asleep she moves her feet she knows I'm touching them she will not she will not have them done I do I managed to get them done because as I say I don't like the long toenails so we do just have to battle on and um, do it but I don't want her feeling like that every time I suggest we cut her nails so anyway let's get safe to bed get some washing on and then we'll do our little spa morning asleep now we're a bit far away don't know if you can see her just in a cot there i can see her can you see her yeah so i but said got the same purchase like me. yeah so i said i would do a little spa with the girls it's not really a spa but you know a bit of girly time I don't isn't want it my toenails cut. you don't want your toenails cut no okay not today but you do need them no, done another day Come and show everybody your curly hair. I've just done it in a low ponytail because that's what she asked for. Sit down. She's dressed up. Sit up a bit. And this lovely ringlet came. How pretty is that? I haven't curled that. That's just her own natural hair. But it's beautiful. Do you want to... You could soak your feet if you like. You don't have to have your toenails cut. But you can soak them if you like in a minute. And have your toenails done. Would you like mummy to do that? Nail no. polish. You don't want to dunk them in the water? Yes, mm. nice and warm. I'm not going to cut them today. Yeah, she's not going to I'm going to cut Ava's. Them. I'm going to cut yours. Yeah. And then you'll put nail polish on it. Do you want nail polish on your toes? Yeah, not cutting. Not cutting, no. We won't do them today, but we do need to do them another day, okay? Well, when I go back to the school, uh, and when I have to go to bed today, will, I ha will you have to take it off? Yes, you're not allowed nail varnish for school, are you? Or bed. I bought these um, nail varnishes for yeah, Ava um, for her birthday. I want, yeah. Um, Do you want rainbow? Yes. yes. With this one. They're really rubbish. They'll peel off by the end um, of the day. Snow white. Oh. Yeah, they've got all, I don't know if you can see, they've got all different Disney princesses <laughs> on the lids. And they're, the bottles look like dresses. They're quite sweet. And they're, they're, they are kids. Um, mummy doing nail polish. All right. They are kids' nail varnishes, hence why they peel off. Also, mummy, I want nail polish for my birthday. Do you? Well, yes. you are a big. How old are you going to be on your next birthday? One. No. no. How many is this? Three. No. Count nine. mummy's fingers. One, two, 
grade four. Four, you're going to be four. Be, she's going to be four and she'll be in reception. Yeah, but that's not till next year. Yeah. So I we'll see, we'll see what Daddy says. And can you do a spa for me? Yeah, I can do a spa for you. One minute. Really can you do a little hair for me? I've done your hair. Well, I've done I Ava's do, as well. Like but I my fingers. It's not that cold. How many have you got? One, mm -hmm. two, two, three, four. How many fingers have you got? Five fingers on your hand. Yeah, do excuse us all in our pyjamas, but do this. I don't see the point in getting dressed can when we're just at home. We're not doing me. anything today, so Wait, this is what my life is like. I don't get dressed. One minute, and one minute. I don't get dressed when I'm just at home and I'm not going out. If we was going out for a walk, obviously I would have got us dressed earlier, but we're just having a chilled one at home today, so yes. Pyjamas it is. I mean, the top half you wouldn't really know... Um, wasn't a, a stripy t-shirt but with the stripy bottoms i think you can uh, gather anyway let's hair. it's beautiful lulu yeah. right should we dry your feet yeah right lulu do you want to soak your feet yeah. do you want to put your feet in the water lift your dress up a little bit oh look at princess's feet under here oh. one two yeah. oh jeez right lift your dress up a little bit don't show your knickknacks please right let me dry them off then. Now I can have my toenails done when Lulu. Yeah, I'm going to cut your toenails first. Not mine. No, we won't do yours today, but you must have them done another day, okay? See, when I this one. Why don't we... Do you want Mummy to try and cut your toes? No. No? You don't want to watch Mummy's pop pop? No. And we do them? Oh, what do you think? No. No, not today? I think feet in at them. But putting them in the water makes the nails nice and soft so it doesn't hurt. Yeah. It doesn't hurt anyway. Oh, mine but... are very soft. And they got wrinkly toes. I get wrinkly toes. Me? Go yeah. to my toes. Okay, baby. Right, Abe, just lift your feet up a minute. Let me shuffle this across to Lulu. Wait, shall I Go get out my, the, the nail polish? No, no, I want to cut your toes first. Okay. Well, not your toes, but your toenails. <laughs> not nice. my feet. But nice and warm. Not my Come on then, give me your stinky toes. Poor, when you do it, I'll get the nail polish I want. Poor, they're I cheesy want, snips. Want Are yours cheesy snips? Ooh, I put some, um, it's just warm water and I've just put some Child's Farm soap in there. It's the pineapple one and watermelon. I love it, that's my favourite. And her feet like smell of that one. Right? Yeah, that's a nice colour, eh? Yeah. Let mummy just cut it's them. teal. Teal, yeah. What do we need to get Auntie Bessie to do before you go back to school? Mm, hair. Hair, we need Ooh, to get your hair cut, don't we? Lulu, you like having your hair cut, don't you? Yeah. Can't get her to cut the toenails, but hair, no problem, is it? You like having your hair cut. And thankfully, their auntie is a hairdresser, so she can just come to us and do it. Oh.
I'm just in the kitchen cooking the girls dinner it's nearly ready nothing exciting today I've just done them fish fingers and super noodles what I do is um, cook the super noodles up and then put them on their plate because they take ages to cool down so by the time the fish fingers have finished cooking they can eat the noodles first and then the fish fingers will have cooled down anyway how boring um, Soph is still asleep she's been asleep for ages um, but we have been out a lot this week which has kind of meant she's not been able to nap properly so she's mostly really catching up Sorry, I can't hold the camera up very high. My, it aches my arms. Um, who's been watching Love Island? I've absolutely loved it this year. Um, really, really sad that Liberty has left. Not fussed on Jake. I did like him, but I'm not bothered that he's gone. But I'm so pleased that Libby, Libby, Liberty decided to put herself first and her feelings and trusted her gut in what it was telling her. So, yeah. Who do you think's going to win? I know Liam was a bit of an arse, wasn't he, in Casa Amor, but I love Millie and Liam. I think they're a lovely couple. And I know Faye is most probably a controversial one, but I really like her. Um, I didn't like how she spoke to Teddy the other week. I thought that was absolutely disgusting. But if we're honest, we can all be guilty of... Um, going too far sometimes um, and what I like about Faye is is that she will she will kick off but once she's calmed down and reflected on it she will go and apologize um, which I really like that about her at least she can hold her hands up and say yeah I did do wrong and I apologize for that so I admire that in somebody and I try and do that myself because I can I can be a bit fiery on the odd occasion <laughs> Martin will let you know um, so yeah, I'm gonna go, my arm's aching. I'm gonna go get the little girl up. Um, I might just slowly and gently speak through the speaker so she wakes up slowly, because dinner's gonna be ready any minute and hers is gonna be going cold. She's up, she's up, she's up, she's up. Just in time for din -dins. Let's go see. Hello, baby. Did you have a nice sleep? Who's that? Hiya! Happy girl! You woke up just in time for din dins. We've got two minutes left on the timer. Yeah? Should we go eat din dins? Oh. Say hello! Can you say hi? Look at your hair! You're looking fabulous! It's a nice rest. Oh, careful, darling. You happy to see Mama? Yeah? Should we go get Din Din's? Yeah? Yeah. Let's go. You eating your Din Din's? Cheese. Cheese. So, she is finishing off her dinner. I've washed all the dishes up. And me and the girlies are going to have a game of... Double. Double. Yeah? Yeah. And did they what did you get that for, Ava? Uh, Can you remember when we, you got that? Christmas or my birthday? It was Christmas. Christmas! Yeah. Did we play at Christmas? Yeah, we did. Yay! Did we all play it? Yeah, Nana and Granddad. Lulu? Um, I don't know if Daddy did. Yeah, Lulu and Mummy. And Mom. me? Yeah. We got both. No, she's too small, isn't she? <laughs> yeah. Come on then, let's play. <laughs> Been on and off again and again I don't know which way we're going No control You push me then you pull me back in Don't know if I can decipher How your mind works Yeah, you leave me wondering What it's like to feel your skin I will keep on trying till You give me a sign Give me a sign Ah, oh, give me a sign Baby, give me a sign Just give me one more You leave me hanging, begging for more Think that I'm addicted to this Can't resist to be a little risky and go For it cause I want you close I'm so exposed when you're keeping me wondering You know I'd do anything To be in your arms again 
So give me a sign Give me a sign Oh, give me a sign Baby, give me a sign Just give me one more Talking to you Here we go again Staying up all night to see if you've been texting me Where do we go from here? I wanna go all in So give me a sign Go for this, no more tricks We could take things slow Say, you think about it too When the lights go out And there's no doubt that I should be with That I should be We've been on and off again and again I don't know which way we're going No control, you push me then you pull me back in mm -mm -mm. We've been on and off again and again I don't know which way we're going, no control You push me, then you pull me back in So give me a sign Give me a sign Baby, just give me a sign Baby, give me a sign Just give me one more Talking to you and here we go again Staying up all night to see if you've been texting me Where do we go from here? I wanna go all in So give me a sign again I'm just watching, excuse me I'm just watching the girls they're playing out in the garden but I thought I would wrap the vlog up here um, I filmed our morning it's nearly two o'clock now Martin will be home soon so we're gonna just spend the afternoon with him he's actually just phoned me what are you pointing at flowers flowers um, yeah, his dad phoned him up saying can he give him a lift somewhere so he's going to do that before he comes home um, So I'll be home a bit bit later than usual flowers. Can you show everybody say? Where's your hair? How so if you're digging your toes in I've constantly got bruises on me because they dig their feet in don't they? Sophie, where's your hair? Where's your hair? No, that's mummy and Sophie in there. Hello, baby. Where's your hair? Not going to do it, make me look like an idiot? I've just been trying to film her walking. Will she do it because I'm trying to film her? No, barely do it. Can you see your sisters out there? Anyway, I thought we would come and say bye-bye. Say bye. Can you say bye? Yeah, that's Sophie in there. Can you see yourself? Thanks for spending the morning with us and early afternoon. We're going to go have a chill the rest of the afternoon the girls are just having five minutes in the garden because it's dry for two minutes so we will leave it there for today i might try and do a daily vlog once a week that let's aim for that to start off with and then hopefully we can increase it because i was thinking earlier i'd really like to attempt vlogmas this year but i don't know if i'm going to have enough content to do it obviously i wouldn't do the days that i work but um yeah we'll see so i kind of need to get my confidence up with doing vlogs on here instead of on my phone and on instagram and then hopefully we will be more confident and ready to do vlogmas so we'll sh we'll see planning ahead already but you're gonna say bye bye say bye bye <laughs> bye bye <laughs> well good girl bye bye say thanks for watching See you in another video. Hi.